let's start creating our achievement section here so inside this section let's take a look at here if is there any spacing so there is above and bottom spacing here right what i can do i can simply select row or i can okay let's select row here and select the design options from here or a style and add some padding and remove this spacer it's not necessary and i think the padding is way bigger than my expectation i think this one looks perfect let's add group here take a look at the design again and there will be three column here or uh, we can create two column which is row i'm not gonna use row i'm gonna use group add column two column here and change the width to wide width after that add some text here which is h3 and then copy which was h4 and after that add some text here normal paragraph and here you can see images on the right side so that's the trickiest part that i'm gonna change it here and you have to understand how it works so i have selected uh, press my shift from my keyboard and select uh, two block at the same time here as you can see i just selected them and i'm gonna make them group but before creating the, them group i would like to take another row here okay so i think inside column i can select here and take row take this at the top and then uh, here you can see uh, this is a row and this is our text here select the text from here and make it group and drag this group into the row and inside this row i'm gonna add an image and from media library or here you can see the image is a girl so what i can do instead using this image exactly i can simply click media library click instant image and type here girl portrait choose this one you can choose any of them and select here you can adjust the height here so let's make it 300 pixel and the height is 300 pixel if you want you can change it to a little bit smaller here this is the aspect ratio so you can change the aspect ratio you can change the width let's uh, change width and aspect ratio at the same time now it looks perfect click on update for test purpose let's have a look here and this is what i wanted to achieve if i compare with the original design there is a color here and the image uh, looks little bit bigger so if i zoom in the image should have a little bit the image should have a little bit bigger uh, zoom out again change the color to this one and change image size 180 click on update and reload the page so it looks like this i can still have 
change the aspect ratio to a square or void portrait standard okay it's very confusing right <laughs> let's click on update and now it looks like this again zoom in I'm happy with the result so there is another part um, which is this one let's create this part zoom out and it has basically uh, text icon and text and text so I can copy the icon from here so there are two column right let's take two column here inside text icon and let's copy the icon here a couple of time or command shift D okay so it's duplicated so copy and I have to paste it here five times one two three four five after that use this text and take a look at the size of this text pop ins which is 70 pixel or 69 so type here 48 and change it Six seventy font appearance bold take it to the top change the color here to okay not background color it should be text color and then rating and here is another one let's take a look at the size of the font 15 pixel 15 pixel and bold so we, we have already uh, 15 pixel and let's make it bold this one also make it bold so here is the result right um, let's select the column style and reduce the block spacing if i set zero it's completely zero let's add some spacing here And compare with the result increase the font size little bit here and also increase letter spacing so from typography uh, later spacing will increase the space of the star here and let's make it smaller a little bit that looks perfect and here you can see there is a little gap uh, between the value and the star icon here so what we can do we can reduce the line height of this text so reduce the line height here and see it's close almost close to our design and increase this spacing a little bit make it uh, 20 it looks great so we are done with this section and I have to just duplicate uh, the section here again what I can do simply remove this column and duplicate this column that's it change it to a plus 
let's change the content and other information simply copy paste students review paste here bb rating also paste here so we are done with this section let's update and except one thing here you can see uh, the alignment is not perfect so what I have to do I have to simply add some padding in this column area so go to the style and add some padding top only top so as you can see it added a little bit bigger padding so I think 13 pixel looks perfect reload so here is the result we have successfully complete this section and now uh, let's add some padding here between uh, them reduce this section and select this group here add some padding bottom or we can reduce the padding top only reload that looks perfect so in our next part i'll be creating the next section